Yeah. What's what's the word? What's the word, man? What's up? What's Come up? What's on, up? bro. Ladies and gents, boys and girls, y'all know what time it is, man. It is Terrence Garvin, aka TG, Pittsburgh still a alum, West Virginia Mountaineer alum, almost heaven. But more importantly, my mother freaking lock me. Ski man, we in here trying to hook Deke up with the lady. So Glorilla came to visit the Steelers. Mm-hmm. Deke kind of looking at Glorilla and he, he kind of blushed a little bit. So we was trying to figure out what was up. Because, you know, Glorilla took the pitch with Coach T. They was kind of close. Mm-hmm. Coach T ain't due to throw with the peace sign. So it just it had us talking, right? <laughs> so mm-hmm. we trying to see with Deke. Deke was checking out Glorilla. Then he was going through Jenna Ortega. Then we had him pull up Sexy Red. You know what I mean? So we just going mm-hmm. through and just shopping for him a little bit, man. Mm-hmm. But Deke don't want to hey. tell, you know what I'm saying? But 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 I think, you know, I feel like we we making some progress in this situation right now, man. Anybody you want to recommend for him? We saw Lizzo come up as well. Uh, nah, I'm not. You uh, stay, stay away from that? You know, yeah, I'm not hip to the, all the the different, the hot takes right now. Yeah, like, okay, you know, okay, okay. I know the Carly Reds. <laughs> I'm in the Carly B's. Them boys said Carly Red. Well, get off a of love of hip-hop, bro. In I'm in the Carly B's. I'm in, like, the, you know. The, the Nicki Minaj's. I got you. Nicki Minaj's. Okay, you, you with the the, 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 the last deck, the last group. This the new group. The Lottos. The, the, oh, what's the, what's the other little, t- it's like a whole little rock of them right now, bro. Yeah. yeah it's like a little, it's a new wave right now, man. <laughs> I still, I'm still here for the city girls. Like, okay, yeah. yeah, city girl. Yeah, I see, I new see, way, I see what you mean. Yeah, cause they, yeah, this, this, this definitely the new way past city girl. Yeah, city girl, D, you might would have been like with a city girl though, bro. You might would have been all right. You, you know, a little scammer. You know what I'm saying? You ain't wrong with a little scammer action. Yeah. He's like the, he's like the new quarterbacks in the league. Like, you know, <laughs> it's the new way. <laughs> well, speaking of quarterbacks, unfortunately, we got to come right at your neck, man. I believe it was Let's Go You Dub. He had asked us to specifically ask you a question. Okay. Um, Let's Go You Dub said, Ask TG how Baker Mayfield 2.0 at USC is doing. Still can't beat Utah. Try telling everyone, don't trust Lincoln Riley coached quarterbacks. Mm. Mm. He, he was off the top rope with it, bro. He was off the top rope, so I figured we would come right to you with this thing to lead off after we get past Deke and all of his uh, potential love interest out there. Mm-hmm. I would trust this this Lincoln Riley potential quarterback. I don't, I don't like that Baker 2.0. I see what he see, though. <laughs> I don't like that Baker 2.0, though. So what does he I say? He see, Elaborate. I mean, because Caleb's a big arm guy. He's a gunslinger. That's his game. Uh-huh. Um, he's a gunslinger. like, But he's not. he's not like... He's not Brett Favre gunslinger. He's more Mahomes gunslinger. Like it's 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 a little bit. It's just. How it's, would you define you the know? difference between the Brett Favre stock? I personally know what you're saying, but for yeah. the listener, how would you describe the difference between a Brett Favre gunslinger and a Patrick Mahomes gunslinger? The Brett Favre gunslinger is more like I'm gonna let it rip. I'm gonna go in these tight windows. I believe in my arm. I believe in my arm ability. While a, a Pat Mahomes gunslinger is more like, I'm going to manipulate you with this arm ability. I'm going to move you a little bit. I can move and still make all the sidearm, just different throws. He's a little bit more of that. He's in the more of like, if you're a quarterback guy, he's more like a Matt Stafford. He's more like a Mahomes. He's more in that category mm. than that. He can stand there. He can move a little bit. He can run. He can throw on the move. He's got a little bit more flavor. So I don't see that. I see the Baker, but he's not. I think he's way better than Baker. I see what he see, though. I ain't mad at you, bro. <laughs> respect, respect. Shout out to Let's Go U-Dub. He's always big in terms of college football, man. He was, you know, big Wyoming guy. So he was heavy on Logan Wilson and stuff like that, man. So I like nah. Penix. I like Penix. Okay, Penix. okay, okay. I like Penix. The lefty be slinging it. Okay. Now nah, he uh, do. He do. You know, I'm a I'm a Washington guy. You know what I mean? You know his team. Shout out to Zim Victor. You know his little bro. You went okay. to UW. You okay. Know, I got okay. Look. Okay. 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 I've okay. seen the Marcus Peters. I seen that whole movie come up. Nah, respect, 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 man. But have uh, your rankings changed at all? Oh, any shifts? Baby. Has your rankings huh? changed? QB rankings, college QB rankings. No, it's Caleb. Caleb's number one. It's still Caleb. I like that boy from uh. Like I said, I like that boy from uh, North Carolina, mm. Maine. I like Penix. He growing on me more and more every week. I like him. 
I like him. I think I'm. I like him a little bit more than I like McCarthy now. Mm, like he okay. just got. He got a big arm. He got some knowledge. You can see he got a big arm. I like him a little bit. Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah. You know, I still like Buddy from Notre Dame. I'm a fan, and you know, Shador's solid. I like Shador. What What, what about Jordan McLeod? Jordan McLeod. Um, He's the quarterback for the 25th ranked football team in college football. He's he's the starting quarterback for the 25th ranked team in, in the AP poll. Is that JMU? The, the 25th ranked team in AP poll. You know. JMU. The, the 25th ranked team in the nation. He's the starting quarterback for them. In, in fact, I believe he's the younger brother of Ray Ray McLeod, if I remember correctly. I think that was. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think that's what they're saying. I think that's the that's court. Right. You know what I'm saying? I'm just. I'm just He's the starting quarterback of the 25th ranked team in all of college football, though. I just didn't know how you felt about him. He he played last Thursday versus Marshall. I don't know if you saw the game. That's all right. Did they did they end up beating Marshall that night? I don't, it was like 20 to 2 at one point. I okay. I think it's a strong possibility they end up winning that game. I think I think uh, it is, man. Disappointing <laughs> Marshall performance, man. <laughs> What's the word? Come on, man. You know what time we on, baby? That's not the Marshall I know. <laughs> I haven't seen Dub V win in a minute. Oh. Man, I'm Whoa. pretty sure I just did pick these two this weekend, right? Uh, no, but you, you got to talk about that Whoa. call. I'm pretty sure. You, you got to you gotta keep the biases aside. Oh, I I hey pick, now. Dude. It was a hey first so down run. Dude, live in a glass house. dude, <laughs> dude <laughs> crossed the yellow line. It, it's a win in my books. In my personal record books, that's about. a win. You're, you're out here dude crossed the, the first down line. Game over. <laughs> TG, they said the irony of it all, it was Wake Forest, man. Said the man, same got, team that the fake slide happened on, man. Man, he out here taking moral victories. Mm, yeah, mm, mm. That's good for him. Everybody was happy with the fake slide last year. The football guy. They, they, they love the fake slide. They did. They did. Yeah. Well, I, do, I got two things to, to say. Forward. One, to wake forward, hey, West Virginia should be worried. Pitt has a quarterback now. Uh -oh. This dude is legit. We, we actually worried. have a quarterback. Uh oh we actually have a quarterback, not not a tight end. We we sent a tight end out there at quarterback against bro, the backyard bro this year. Bro, you're talking about West Virginia versus Oregon State, like a ranked team. I'm not Oregon State, Oklahoma State, a ranked I don't think program. Ranked. They are ranked, for surely ranked, versus <laughs> Wake Forest. Wake Forest. You know? uh, the other thing I wanted to say. TG's been spreading uh, fake news on this oh, podcast no. when it comes to the backyard brawl. Oh, no. Remember after uh -oh. the game, he was like, oh, they ain't playing for another, like, who knows when. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's scheduled for next year. We, we, uh -oh. got, a, we got a home and home these next two years. And then I think there's okay. a year off, and then there's another, like, little home and home. Series. So we got smoke next year, too, then. Yeah, so West Virginia's going to have to worry about this. They said them boys now. coming now, man. I don't know that that's facts, though, because I think that's before all this realignment stuff. I don't know that that's true. Okay. I don't okay. know. If that's true. It might be on the schedule, but I'm not sure that's true. Okay. I'm just not okay. positive okay. that's true. He said, "Be, you know be ready for some sweet Carolina." That's what he ultimately saying. You know they doing all this real. If you look right now, you can go look. Oklahoma and Texas is scheduled to play every year, but we know that's not happening. Oh yeah, you know yeah, what yeah. I mean? with the, yeah with the realignment, so, yeah. Yeah, I don't think they plan for this realignment quite yet. Like I think they got to put that on there and see if that changes stuff for sure. But if we do play, you know what it is. Oh, you knew what it was last week. We back home. You knew what it was. We back home. You came down here. I told and you and we got it a was quarterback. 365 days. Let's I waited go. 365 days, and the boys came to Morgantown and went home. Dude, Let's go. You know I mean? Let's you, go. You, you now were on the clock. It's like 360 days before you could start having convos with me about. Who are those guys over there? You feel me? You talk can't that talk. Time. Talk that you talk. Got you put up on some pit bulls. You got bit. Like you know how it go. You feel me? Like this ain't that. This not Wake Forest. This not Towson. I was listening to stuff all week. It was like this the most dynamic offense this team seen since West Virginia. I was hearing that all mm. week talking about talking okay. about the Penn State Ohio State. I know you was listening. Okay. And this not an explosive year for us. We are what we are. Like I had that game. You remember when King Von was like, "I am what I am." I am what like, I this, am. Let's go. This is what we are. R.I.P. Von one time, man. Like, R.I.P. Von. Yo, it's different. You a little bro. Y'all the little bros over there. Y'all play hard. It ain't that though. Let's go. Let's go. Do that. Y'all the little bros, man. Nah, no, it's fake news. But no, but. How did you feel about the uh, the whole fake slide slide thing, man? Do you feel like it was called at the right location, or would you have called it as a first down, man? Uh, mm, 
I thought it was a. I, I, <laughs> he won't let him say it. Come on. He won't let him do it. Uh, he knows. He knows. <laughs> My dog say, ah, uh, nope, oh, no. nope, oh, no, nothing. I'm not going to nope. do I'm that. I'm not giving you that. Nope, nope. It is what it was. The, they, the call what they, call. <laughs> they, they call, call what they call. They call what they call. I thought it was, you know. The worst call I've ever seen. Hey, yeah. call what they call. The worst call I've ever seen. <laughs> he say, he say, man, it's four quarter game, man. That is one call they going to make a break. That's what he said. One call they going to make a break. I got it, baby. Mm-hmm. Ain't nothing wrong There's with that. There's a couple holding calls that they didn't call. Ain't nothing wrong with that, man. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Let's go. Let's go, man. You see that hold that they didn't call on pit? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You ain't gonna talk about that. You know what I mean? Respect, respect, man. I know you're just throwing that out there because there's holding in every game, every football game. There it is. There it is. I, yeah, who was it, it on? Who's, the, who's the guy? What was the player's is. name? Last year when West Virginia played pit, it was targeting on number seven. They still ain't call that. Mm. Come on. Respect. They get pit all the call. Respect. Well, well speak, okay. speaking of calls, we can easily transition this to the game. How did you feel about said fourth quarter call? The, but, no, uh, the, 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 the QB sneak coming a little, you know what I mean? We saw the knee down. Man, I ain't tripping on it. If you ain't tripping on it, boy, is you tripping? I didn't see the knee down. You know all what right, I mean? All right, all right. I wish you did, you man. Hey, hey, call look good to me. <laughs> call look good to me. Call look good to me. Let's go. It look good to be deep. I don't know what they. They don't ask about. you out. They they ask you how many. Straight light. Yeah, we got screwed over with the Straight, pit call. So light. I'll that. take a call in our favor the next day. That's fine. Absolutely. Balanced out. Absolutely. But um, as a whole, though, TG man, what were your thoughts on the game, bro? Man, I think you can say whatever you want to say about them. Them boys keep with it. They Talk keep throwing about up in that it. W Talk matter. about it. I thought it. I thought it was another ugly win, but them boys know how to win ugly. You feel me? Play hard. They know how to close uh, out, bro. They know how to finish. You know, they know how to finish. I think the defense played pretty well. They didn't play bad. Uh, that run game still trying to find themselves. Mm-hmm. But no matter what you call it, they finding ways to win. Yeah. Uh, I thought that Picky. I thought Picky didn't play bad. He was emotional. I thought the receivers mm, okay. were, they were very emotional. I ain't know what that was about. They was. It, it, was, like, it was the super fired up passion. Everybody was out there talking yeah. crazy. But, you know, it got them a couple of penalties, a couple of big moments. Yeah. So it's like you kind of got to find a way. I know that's going to be an issue this weekend in terms of, like, let's not do that. Yeah. But I thought, it was, you know, hard fought. They're winning, though. You call it whatever you want to call it, they winning. So it's like, I don't know. They winning, you know? For sure. Well, let, 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 let's start with the passion part there, man. Um, Obviously, you brought it up. You said, man, they look super emotional out there. And you think that's something that, at least will be a point of emphasis for the team internally of, hey, man, we got to cut down on this. How do you manage it, though? Because at the same time, I do feel like they play better when they are fired up like that. Because, I, it, I, you know what I mean? Like, they're not this uber-talented where they just show up and say, I'm nicer than you, even if I'm not going full speed. You know what I mean? Like, I can just show up and be better. I feel like at times that is how you bridge the gap. You do got to add that nastiness, that pissed off element. But I'm with you at the same time. You can't get the penalties because it can't kill you. I think I control it, too. You know, like certain moments, that one they got right before it in the fourth quarter, that one that set it back. Like, mm-hmm. that's a big moment. You can't go get that one, you know? Yeah. Like, stuff like that. Like, But I'm all for passion. Like, you love the passion, you know? You love the passion. Like, you want them to play with passion, play with heart, play with purpose. It's kind of like. You still want to get them penalties. No. You know, you don't want them penalties. Like, you kind of point in somebody's face. That's a bad penalty, right? You don't want to take them penalties, you know? Now, is the league soft for calling that, though? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Deke no. said it's soft. Hey, I, Deke won't feel it, bro. Who are you talking about? Was, the that, the I, I don't even remember the Pickens one. The I, Deontay was, yeah, he was, Deontay, he was he, silencing him. He silenced the, uh, to yeah, Witherspoon. That was, that was a soft And then call. GP, yeah. But you can't, you can't search him out to do that. You know what I mean? I'm with you. Like you might can throw a subtle. Back. Like he, he ran a ball. He like walked up on him he to find him. He walked up on him. Like, hey, yo, you see me talking? <laughs> he to walked you. up on. <laughs> you can't do that. You know you can't do that. You can't do that. This ain't like this ain't that. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah. this ain't that. So, no, because like I you thought, said, it turns into something else. That was kind of what I had talked about yesterday. But I was like, it could just you'll see a lot more of them brawls. You'll see a lot more of them rumbles happen. 
if you allow more of the taunt and stuff to but happen. You know, that's a point of emphasis too that they were yeah. big on. You remember Super Bowl when you oh, threw no, the peace already, sign bro. up at Tyreek? Like, yeah. The same thing. Oh, yeah, when that's Brady ran up. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, that was Winfield. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Remember he threw the peace sign and he got in his face. Yeah. Like, I do remember that. Point of emphasis. Yeah. That's yeah. something that they're, they're harping on. Like, we don't want to let this happen. So, you know, they were going to call that. Yeah. But now we got to talk about your back end, though, man. In terms of these these DBs, man, how'd you feel about what was going on versus Puka and Cooper Cup, bro? What's up with our our, our, our DBs, man? I didn't think they played those. That's a tough little matchup, bro. Now, Puka, I'm with you, but bro. they don't respect Puka around here. They don't Puka, talk about Puka, Puka like that. Problem. Me and Deke are on the Puka. We, me and you, you, you seen Puka. We was, we, I don't know. I'm 50-50 on him. Oh, you 50-50 just, on him? Oh. He shouldn't have had that good of a oh, game. Puka, I'm sorry. Yeah. Thought, everything the Rams do, everything the Rams do is an option route. Yeah. So with all them option routes, if you good at like really selling their route basketball, you got a two way go. Yeah. And it's like it's one on one. Yeah. So if you on target with your quarterback, you get that one on one. They get there on time. You got action. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Puka, Puka got a little relate. You could tell he's the dude that's been after practice every day. Yes. Yes. Every day, he got a relationship with the quarterback, so he on time. You know what he thinking? They thinking the same thing. So it's connecting a little bit. I didn't think JPJ played bad. I think JPJ been playing good. Like he's yeah. a, he, he's he's in attention. He's got your he's got he he <laughs> that's he his played eye. a lot this last game, man. He yeah, played a lot, bro. Eighty like, percent. Yeah, he right. was out there, bro. I think that's corner one at this point. Like, what's the other one? You know, I think we'll that's kind of how trades it is. right now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. I think trade conversations are gonna start popping up. Like, you want OG? We'll give you the OG. You know who, who's the OG? Is it, we need to talk. Who? who, who oh, you. Oh, you. Oh, you <laughs> I just cool what you said. <laughs> you talking about Pat P or Najee? You want the OG, man? We like to give you the OG for the right take, number. Take the OG and a pick. What's that? Yeah, OG and a OG? pick. You can get that. Pat P. Pat P. Yeah. Throw him a little. Throw him a little of that with a little pick. Yeah. I'd rather Don't toss in Levi round, Wallace than Pat P. Second round pick, you can have. Him. <laughs> say, yo, I'm good. <laughs> yeah, you can have it. But hey, hey. that's yeah. not the one that people want to move on from. They want to move you on know. from the younger version. Yeah. Now when I huh. Levi, they, oh, they, the they ain't digging live. Yeah, they ain't digging Levi like that, bro. Yeah. I don't think you better sell that like that though. I kind of agree. I think, I think it's easy to sell the name than it is to sell Levi. That's yeah. why I said the OG. Like, yeah. I think you should sell the name of Pat. Hall of Famer. And seriously. Yeah. yeah. I think that's definitely easier to sell than Levi that's right I now. Like, yeah. I don't, I don't think it's so much on Pat's worse than Levi. I'm not saying it like that. All I right. just think you can get something off with Pat. I don't mm-hmm. think you'll get nothing off with Levi. No. Yeah. You know? With Levi, you're going to have to heavy, 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 heavy draft pick. Yeah. But Pat P. Yeah, people buy that, man. Because you've either been burnt by him or you've been a fan of him, but you know it's like, yo, it's Pat. So you just kind of, yeah. yeah. If you're Omar, are you going hard for a cornerback? Whether it's, you know, Pastor Tan, we've talked J.C. Horn, Jalen Johnson from the Bears. Mm. Are you, are you like, really out there pushing for it, being aggressive? Jay Alexander? I definitely think it's, I'm making phone calls. I'm making sure, okay. you know. How does the oh. phone call start then? Where, 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 where is the number? Where we where we at? What's the initial? Hey yo, what's up, man? I know y'all got Pat over there, bro. I got such and such and such for you. Where are we starting at? Yeah, man, you got Pastor Ten. Uh huh. Because he's twenty three. He vibed out. You know that. We oh, feeling man. great about him. Yeah, yeah. Got a first round and a <clears> running back. What you gonna do? And a running back. I don't need that. Them, they the Minister Goods right that. there, bro. All right, you sound and, solid. And, I have to and, make sure. and, and let's be real. You the Steelers. Y'all sitting at four and two right now, man. Y'all kind of hot over there. That True. first round pick gonna be in them twenties. What I'm gonna do with that? Still a first round pick though. Man, know? when was their ten pick? Like 17, 18. Okay, fair enough. What has Sertan been since coming into the NFL? Then let's get to that point. I give you a first round, dude. Uh-huh. You know, Broncos, you want a fire sale. You want any pick. I, I need assets. I need way more assets than that, though. I give you a first. I give you a first and a third. What you trying to do? A uh, first, you trying to rob me? And we in the AFC. I'm gonna see you in a couple years. Once I get back, nice. Now I gotta go I play against you, my I pissed off you, corner. Come on, bro. I Why you doing me like that? Year. I give you my first this year, my first next year. Let's first this out. year, first next year. Let me get it. Can I get a second in there too? Um, you got my first this year, bro. My first. 
I if needed I, how many sister, how many you you how many sister. first round picks you didn't had that didn't work out? I didn't seen an already come through. I didn't seen a Devin come through there. And now you, you want and now you going now you want to trade that for No, I'm good, man. Uh uh-uh, uh I need a little extra on that. Uh-huh. My first next year. Mm-hmm. I give you I give you a, a four. Give me Jared Judy and give me uh Pat Sertan. Let me get them off your hands and then I'm a ship. Can you send back GP? Huh? Can you send back GP? You want Judy in there? Can I get GP with it? No. I hang no. up. If I'm saying, bro, you want certain is better than anybody that we offer right now. What are we if talking name, about? If you name GP, I'm hanging up the phone. Bro, you naming Judy with certain hauling that little package, man. I'm hanging up the way. phone. What are we talking about, Uncle, man? Uncle's is trying to get out of way. Bro. I think way. Judy, you got a better chance of giving them low ball deals. I think Sertan, they're gonna play hardball with him, man. I think they're man. still would move him, but I think they're gonna wait till they get the absolute best offer for him, man. They just waiting on the best deal. I'll wait till yeah. the last day. So let's be but real. So now let's flip it. If you're the Broncos and Deke is giving you that same offer. Give me the first, give me your first, next two first, and a next two first, a third, and something. Yeah, now, take, now, when I just said that to I you, could, you said you didn't want to do that. I could live with that. Take it off. I could live with that. I'll throw you leave out too. Broncos. I'm the Broncos. I'm on a fire sale. I'm gonna let okay. all this. Shit. I'm gonna let everything. Okay. <laughs> okay. Everything I can let go. Go. All if I'm I saying let, is, man, a do it like certain. Wilson, go, if you can, but if you can get it, you're gonna maximize what you could get it for because that is your biggest oh, chip. That is the most important asset first. you have, bro. You offered me two first. That's a nice. That's a nice offer. All right, two, two first and a third, and two Levi. And third. I like the third. You, you said two first and the third. Keep the third in there. You can't take the third out now. Keep my third in there. I take that. All right, respect. Yeah. Wow, done and deal. Respect. I would have given you more. Respect, respect. And I'm giving you two pieces. I'm giving you Pat. Oh wait, you're giving me I'm, Judy, I'm, too. bro. It's no way you're giving Pat and Judy for two first and a third, bro. <laughs> Yeah, I'll, you take oh, you like, I'll take that. I'll take that. If that's the case, what we waiting on then, bro? Well, if that, I if think we both have. It. <clears throat> listen, got, if it takes two first and a third, and a third to get Pat Sertan I'll sign and Gunner Judy, back and we're doing that, too. bro. What are we talking I about, man? I think that's a good deal. I think that's a good deal. You, you guys a good deal? First. You want Gunner? You got two first for a Pat. Jared Judy's gonna go for like a seventh in like a couple days. I don't know. She don't know. They about to just get out of way. I got a, I got a third for Jared Judy, and I got two first for Pat Sertan. I won. Okay. I won. Maybe it's one of those deals you're just building rapport for down the line that, between GMs. That could definitely be a team. Hey, look, listen, I took care of you That's here. What I'm hey, look, I give you on the front end, you get me on the back yeah, end. Yeah. 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 We need to make a trade. On the Take back care end, of me. On the back end, I might, I might turn this into, like, Marvin Harrison Jr. somehow. Mm, somehow. Okay, okay, okay. Respect. Respect. I might turn it into Caleb Williams somehow. Uh oh. Because I'll sell everything I <laughs> got. They go flip these picks, bro. We're going to get this working. Yeah. Flip these picks and give me Caleb. Listen, if that's what the Broncos GM's willing to do, I'm our con. Needs to get on this immediately. No, seriously, bro. If, if literally, if that's the package, I'm down for that. That is not a lot, bro. That's not a big ask. we talking two first rounds and a third. That's not a big ask. At the end of the day, if I'm the Broncos. I'm doing whatever I got to do to try to find my way to get Caleb. Okay, you know so I mean? let's talk then. If you're telling me two picks for Sertan, what does Jair Alexander go for to you? See, I think Sertan's the better of the two. You no, I, mean? I do too, and he's younger. So if you're yeah, telling you me. Okay. That's all I'm like. You offer me two, two first for that. Here, take it. But if I'm Would the you do Packers, like a first I'm, and the third, maybe? So that's what I'm saying. So so, what I'm saying. Okay. But this is what I'm saying. The Packers aren't in the same give everything up that the that the Broncos are on fire sale over there. Okay. Everything can go. Everything can go. It's nothing that's not for sale over there. You see what I mean? <laughs> I so, do. Packers should get that mentality, I do, though. but I feel like Sertan is not the first piece that they're trying to move off the table, though. No, I not, feel like that's the one that they're going to wait and hold big. for the most. Yeah, I'm going I'm to kidnap it as long as I can, yeah. but I'm looking for it's a Minka situation. It's the same thing. Okay. It's the same thing. See, it's I don't like, agree because Minka was after one year and he wasn't as established as Sertan is right now. Sertan is viewed as one of the top corners, top three debate. Like, huh? Oh, what you say, bro? I said Sertan ain't been in there. Wait, this is year two. No. Uh, going into year three. He's going into year three. He's yeah. Two years. Yeah. Year three. 
We seen Mika yeah. have one season and then we traded for him in the beginning of year two. Bro, we knew what that was. Bro, was we traded for him thing. in the beginning of year two, though. I don't say it was the beginning of year two. That's all I'm saying. We're Satan is further along, bro. Ah. It's a fire sale. They're okay. selling everything. Everything's for sale. If they could sell Russell, they would sell Russell. They're trying to sell everything. Everybody can go. It's okay. a fire sale. Okay. Everybody, it's nothing in here that's stable. Nothing in here is safe. I Nothing hope you are here. right because if that's the case, then Omar, what are you waiting on, man? Go ahead, call that up because we making that move. We know Sir Tan nice, and if that's all it's going to take us to first, go get him. Or do you? Or you not make? I say you making that move. Where I think all three of us in here agree with that, right? Yeah. If we just saying two first, I'd throw in a second or a third if I had to. If if it's between us and another team or two, and I'd have to. I'm getting yeah, a third. Give a little too. more. Man, I'm trying to like, yeah. I'm if all, if all we talking there. two first and a third, I'm like, bro, I still like that. I think that's a good trade for everybody. I, I think like you're that. looking at it like that's crazy. I'm like, no, no you're giving up two first. When you throw in Jerry Judy as well, and you're saying two first and a third, I'm like, yeah, that is crazy because. But, but you're still in Jerry Judy. You gotta think these people are gonna give away Jerry Judy. You might not Judy even first. play. Yeah. All right, all right. They're about okay. to give Jerry Judy away. All right, like Jerry I said. Judy. I hope you're right. And if you are right, I hope we are the ones to prove that you are right. That's all I'm saying, baby. I would yeah. love it if that's all it's going to take. I just think it's going to take more. Personally, I just think it will. I just, yeah, <clears throat> what would TJ oh, Watt call? You see what I'm saying? Like I think of like the marquee sex positions. Quarterback, pass rusher, corner, left tackle, wide receiver. I know it's not TJ Watt. I'm just simply saying it plays the sexy position and is viewed as a top five at that position and is 23 years old. That's what I'm saying. It's a lot that goes into that. You know that. Why you think they get paid where they get paid and everybody go crazy for them? No, that's not, you know that's not a why. That's not a turn. I ain't say it why. was a why I did, but I'm saying in terms of how it's viewed in the league. Does anybody view Sir Tan as not top five? Mm, no, but he's still young. He's still okay. young. You know what I mean? I don't think his name pops up in them conversations simply because of how young he still is. You know what I mean? So where you're not even like you're not saying words like what's he gonna make and top like it's not yeah. that He's so young. You know? So I think with him being so young on top of that, mm -hmm. I think the value that we're saying, like, yeah, he's an elite corner, yeah, but he's still so young. You with me? To where it's like, I don't know. I might would you, trade would you... I don't know. I just think you can make that trade. I think it's a phone call that definitely should be called. Oh no, no, no. You definitely making the phone call. You got to make the phone call. And I'm start with that offer you said. The two first. I'm like, yeah, man, we talk with these two first rounds, bro. You going to take the two first? Yeah, because he's already he at least worth yeah. one first. Right. You would do the first round for Patrick Tan swap all day, every day. And you're still going to need to do the contract afterwards because, right. like I said, it's year three. Yeah. So and he, I think he's worth the top dollar of I'm with you. Premier cornerback. How do you, you feel about him, that, TG? You lock him side by side right. with JPJ for the next five, six years. That's worth it. Because after you make sure. the trade, you're still going to have to lock it up, right? So we're saying, well, you still paying that top dollar as well then, right? Yeah, you're going to lock it up. You're going to pay for it. Okay, you made it sound like you were second-guessing it. Like, it's kind of young, but I don't know. Definitely a Tomlin type of player, though. Dad, no, former pro back yeah. in the day. He got the pedigree. <laughs> you're going to pay, yeah. Oh, he Tom would it's be a loving line. He would love it. You know he would oh, love it. Oh, you got Porter line. with his dad. Yeah, it's a bloodline. And you got line. Shertan with his dad as your top two cornerback. Yeah. He would love it. And came I from Alabama, too. Awesome. Yeah. He likes those SEC guys. Uh, yeah, you're Georgia. right. Roll tie. Come on, man. Yeah. The only thing that hurts him is it that he is an a a AFC guy. Yeah. That's the part Because that you in the same con. Uh, yeah. Yep. Yeah, I don't know if I want to see that. Because you got the potential. If I feel like, like you said, you go get Caleb. Okay, cool. You gonna see me in a couple of years potentially then. Yeah. Man, if we talking too first though. I mean, if you Denver, if you feel like that's straight, I ain't too tripping. first. You say like two first ain't a lot though. Two first is big. bro, but we talking two first for a team that's gonna be picking in the mid to the back potentially. Yeah. So that is a difference. We we agree that's a difference. A top two top five first round is in a seventeen to thirty two first round is big difference, man. I mean, but you just got JPJ in the late first. True. You've seen that working out. Right now, you yes, know? but it's a very small sample size. I just don't think it's I'm, – I'm with you. I hear what you're saying. Like, I feel you. I definitely do. I just don't think it's like that the way you like. I can't make this move. For sure. And I'm not saying that you can't. I'm just saying that I don't think they're going to just 
give him away for a, a regular offer. I think they're going to make you go above and beyond. They're going to make you take that extra step. Pay a dollar and a half. That's what I'm saying, yeah. <laughs> because, premium. okay, if two first rounders is logical, I don't want logical because I know what this is already proven. This draft we know is a crapshoot. So I want a little bit more. That's how I look at it if I'm Especially them. if there's a market, if there's like three, four, right. five other teams. And we know it's going to be a market for Pat Sertan. Or at least it should be. Yeah, if the base is two yeah. first and you got to throw in a second or third. Like, Who's willing to go to next? Right. Right. Who's going to go to that extra? Who's going to do that next thing? I'll do it. Because we Man, all agree that two three, first, bro. but we all agree that two first rounds is logical. We all agree that two first rounds is, is perfect. We've given you all the first we can give you. So if every if so if my uh, my team offering two first rounders, deep team offering two first rounders, you offering two first rounders, you ain't willing to do something to separate yourself because when they say Steelers two first rounders and we say okay this is the Jets two first rounders, I'm not saying it's really gonna be the Jets, but just for conversation purposes, that first a round pick might be sexier than our first round pick. Yeah. Us. Well, a team that's likely to be worse than I don't know if they're making the Shatan. That's though. the question. You're right. <laughs> Yeah, what are, I don't even know what teams are in the mix for. Nah. I'm seeing the Eagles floated out there. No. They enough, just traded for Kevin Byer. Yeah, enough of these Eagles. Eagles just they just went. They just went and got Kevin Byer. No, they, enough of those. But they got Slade. Players. They got uh, Brad Brace, though. Yeah, yeah, they can't hey, keep doing this. Why, why, are we like, why are we acting like Bynum's just a normal person? Like, that's all pro. No, 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 no. He said, I said, that's why they don't need to go get Sertan because they already just got Kevin Byer. And they still have Slay and Bradbury. Yeah, That's what I said. Just trying yeah. to float Eagles into yeah, all these yeah. No, bro. Kevin Barr, nice. You sleep if you don't know Kevin Barr, bro. Absolutely. He nice. I'm with you. He a ball hawk. He gonna get that rock, bro. I thought that was an elite trade. Man, nah. for the Eagles, I, I think man, the Eagles they came up. That's a dope move for them. We was over here looking at Edmonds like, bro, you ready to come back home? Hey, mm-hmm. you bring like up. Evan- <laughs> uh, I was about to say. The trade, uh, uh, no, nah, I was I was about to go to a, a trade. Look, Mike Evans is who they should target, though. Huh. They should go try to see about something like that, and then now to get them leverage to trade something to get some. Like they could like do some things right now. Oh, you know who, who, are you talking about the Eagles? Oh, you or talk, the yeah, which team? Which team? Uh, I was talking about. No, so I think the e- no, I was talking about the Steelers. If I was the Steelers, I'd make some moves with it. Like okay. I, 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 yeah, I put, think, put, put your I GM think, hat on there, TG. GM, yeah. TG, what you got, man? What, you, what move you I making? Would go, I would go try to, like, take something like uh, Because I think the target is corner. You know what I mean? Like, right. you agree, the target is corner. But then you could do something like you. I would get, like, leverage Like, I'd try to get, like, maybe a Mike Evans. You know what I mean? And I might leverage that and trade, like, uh, I'd leverage maybe, like, a Deontay, uh, two first-round picks. And, like, you know what I mean? Maybe even a third. That's a nice package for that corner. I'd rather throw and an maybe, A-Rob or Calvin Austin than Deontay. Yeah, you, you see what I'm saying? Like, I'll leverage some stuff and, like, all right, you can get all this. Let me get that corner. Maybe give me a third. Okay, or, okay, me, okay. Like, okay. Like, I kind of basketball it. Like, I'd be like. That's exactly you what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. use them pieces like assets, man. Absolutely. I mean, yeah. I mean let me get I'm one like, of them players in a pick. All right. We ain't get you all pick. Yeah. We get player to pick, combo this thing up. What's that? Okay. Like you might not be here for a day before I ship you on out of Yeah. Like, I see it. A little sign yeah. and trade. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. yeah. Little, little pass through action. Is available. Oh. Hopkins. D hop, yeah. Titans are one of those teams. It seems it's gonna be a fire show. <clears throat> Titans one of them teams giving up everything. I'm surprised the Eagles didn't try to get Hopkins instead. They went for Julio. Like, I could have seen that Hopkins working out with them. Julio's cheaper though, right? Is he way cheaper? Yeah, Julio was out. Yeah, I think that's why he was just cheaper. Yeah, I could see that. That Because you still got AJ. You still have uh, Devontae over there too, man. Yeah, let me get the cheaper. Yeah, take that. They say Derrick Henry about to get moved next. I heard that. Bringing the piss (laughs) away. Nah. I don't think that's the one you're looking for. <laughs> Derek Henry needs to go somewhere like, it sounds crazy, dare I say it, Buffalo. Oh, you know I've been on that. Come on, man. Talk to me nice, man. Talk to me nice. Buffalo. You know I would love that, man. The Thunder and Lightning, yeah, James Cook, Derek Henry. Oh, man. Got Latavia. Oh, man. It would be beautiful, baby. You know that? It I would love sense. that. I would love it. Makes sense. But I think I I, I hope that Buffalo's in the Pat Sertan uh, sweepstakes. That's what I'm hoping. 
Okay. Oh damn. And I'm just saying we being real about it. Well, y'all talking two. Y'all saying two first round. And I'm like, I'm like, right listen, now. man, we can take them two oh, first round. If that's all it's gonna take, two first rounds, real quick, bro. Well, that's the way, man. All right, Brandon Bean, what's up, man? Just make a little too quick. All right. So I'm with you. I'm with you. I'm with you. Oh man. I'm you. Just saying. Mm-hmm. Just check it. I'm just checking, just checking. Just checking. Patrick, tan, sweet, sweet. It's, it's a lot of people that's looking at it. That's all I'm saying. It's a lot of people that got eyes on it. That's all I'm saying. It's a lot of people that got eyes like on it. Sweet, okay. Sweet, he ain't, he, he, y'all thought the black girl was the only one that was worried about Pat? Y'all, all right. Okay. We okay. have to make that. I heard, all right. Dalvin Cook is, I heard Dalvin Cook's for sale. Uh huh. He is because they said they ain't, the uses just went down. Yeah. They said yeah, that they don't right. need him right now. Mm-hmm. Go back to the Vikings. Bad. That's what they should do. Low key, it makes go sense. Go back to the what? You said go back to the Vikings? He's the type. Should go to Buffalo. His brother there, too? Yeah. It'll work. Buffalo. It'll work. Wh- which one do you think works better? Cook or Henry? Cook. Okay. Ah. Right. I don't think... <laughs> That's still King Henry. Bro. I'm sitting here like, bro, you crazy, man. Give me Derek Curry and I love it. Nah, that's still King I love Henry, it. <laughs> King Henry, you gotta step in front of that. <laughs> right, bro. That's a Mack truck. I don't care what y'all talk about. It is that's cold so, up there. Good luck. Yo, with the problems. You could be having a bad week. You know? <laughs> he didn't ruin a lot of people's days, man. He didn't ruin a lot of people's could days. Be having a bad week. Yeah. yeah I'm, I'm, that's just tough. All right. Respect. Respect. All right. All right. Well, final one that I got. I got to ask you about, uh, Upcoming week, man. How you feeling about the Jacksonville Jaguars matchup, man? We looking good. We looking nice. What's the energy? Uh, I'm feeling good, man. I think I think Jacksonville's a good team, though. You know? Okay. I think they're a real good team. I think they're a team you need to know what they, you know, they're dangerous. They got an offense. They're dangerous. I think Jacksonville is the next up type team. They're just a couple of pieces away. But uh, I think they'll win. You know, Pittsburgh find a way to win. Can't never doubt them right now. Okay. They find ways to win. They find ways to win. It's that right? clutch quarterback. I was going to ask you too, man. Speaking of find ways to win, because the Jags, they're they have four wins in a row right now, man. They okay. had some crazy like little clutch performances yeah, they're, too. They're yeah, this is a good yeah. game. This is just an all around good game. They should be bumping this to like the four o'clock spot. Low key. Low so key. what you saying? I think you're on the Jets bandwagon. You said what? Y'all join the Jets wagon? The Jets wagon? What you mean? Oh, I thought you were just talking about the Jets. Let's say you joined the Jets. No, no, the, no we the said Jags this game, the Jags are a solid team, so they, uh, they should flex this game, man. Still is in, in Jags. That's what they should have done. That's what we're saying. You think so? I mean, it's what we think. Five who, and two and four and two week? team? I don't know. Who's, who, who got, yeah, who's who the primetime this week? Because Bills, Bills, Bills got the Thursday night. They got uh, they got your boy Baker. Are we okay. in week eight already? Yeah, we are. Dang. Oh. Fine by low key. We about to find out right now. Hold on. Yeah, Bills Buccaneers tomorrow, mm-hmm. Thursday night. Definitely tune in for that. That's be a good one. Just in terms of like later games, I'll give you those. Hold on. Who got them four o'clock? Who got them prime times, man? Brown Seahawks at four o'clock. Forty Nine ers Bengals four o'clock. Broncos right. Chiefs at four o'clock. It's Mahomes though. It's Mahomes. Cardinals Ravens at four o'clock. And... It's probably due to it being a West Coast yeah. game. Yeah. Yeah, the Sunday night game sucks. Chargers, Bears, and then Monday night, not good either. Chargers, Lions, Raiders. Bears, they, but they, they, they got that out of there. But, but you know, they like Herbert, though, man. They they like Herbert. I think it's too early nah, for the flex anyway, it. isn't it? After Yeah, like, I think it's after 10 or the, 11. Yeah. But they like Herbert. They, they like Fields, young quarterbacks. You know that. He might not even play, though. It's going to be that dude oh, from the D2 school. you're right. He won last week, though. He did. Yeah, he was straight. Some, he some are saying he, he won last week, bro. Fields. Yeah. You know how some, you know how it is, man. If you let them see it without you, it get weird. Hey, what's up in Cleveland? They seeing it without him. It, it, all right, how you feeling about Cleveland situation, weird. man? Look a little weird. Cleveland, Cleveland want that money back. So it look weird right now. I'm like, yeah, dog, bro. Oh, mm, this is bad. This bad for business, baby. Yeah, that's one of the worst deals. Like ever. they're talking yeah. about trying to trade back for Jacoby Brissett or bro, Josh it's Dog. Crazy right out. now. <laughs> but we was talking. We was like, yo, it's like they look better without him. It's nuts, nice, man. Mm-mm. But man, that's how that be, but bro. I hear, you can, I hear you can still go get a um, and I know there's no need for him at this mm-hmm. point, but you can still go get a Chase Young out here. It's still available. Like I know there's no need for him, but do you make that phone call? <sighs> 
Golden and Herbert have been doing too yeah, good. Yeah, I'm like... And they're not hurt or I anything? I just don't think we need to do it. Okay. I wouldn't hate it, obviously, because he's a heck of a player, but I don't think we need to do it. I okay. think we roll with the young cat. I think in the offseason, I think it's different. I think this all season, be a bad time to get him because he's been underperforming thus yeah. far this year. And this is his contract, this contract year, right? Yeah, yeah. So for the last eight weeks of the season, team trades for you, you got to figure he's going to be trying to do everything, yeah. get that contract number up in the offseason. He'll be motivated. I just but don't know how much PT time, is going to get here with if, Highsmith if, and Watt yeah, Cook. Yeah, man. And I'm like, what you waiting on? Right. That's my thing. It's the contract year, but it's like, I ain't watched a lot of Washington this year, so I can't even, you know, speak to it like that. I watched the Bills game. Mm. Uh, uh, he's got five sacks. Okay. That's actually not bad. Okay, okay, okay. Mm. So, all right. Like I said, I have not watched a ton of them. I know in that Bills game it wasn't anything crazy, but I ain't watched them like that this year either. Two of them came in week. Uh, no, no, no. That was last week. Two of them last week. Okay. One and a half uh, was week one. Okay, okay. Mm. I mean, oh, you no. you the DC man. That, that's your hood. That that, that, that area, DMV boy, all that, yeah, man. Huh, that, 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 that that's your scouting area. Come on, man. <laughs> yeah, no, it's all me, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was, I think I, I'm just more like I'm t- you talking to Chase Young. I yeah, think yeah. That's I think that's something you always make a phone call about. Like, like I said, I would not be tripping. I think you. Always I would make not that be phone tripping. Call. I can assure you, I would not be tripping, bro. Yeah. Like. You you almost let somebody go with that type oh, okay. of phone call. Like, That's what, like, like we appreciate. You. <laughs> <laughs> it's been real, but uh, this is business. Yeah. It's not personal, okay? It's I'm, business. I, I had read something earlier, <clears throat> you know, you just, but I had read something like Derrick Henry to the Ravens sound like a go. Mm. That'd be dangerous. Yeah, I don't want that. Mm-mm. That'd be. Dangerous. I don't like that at all, personally. That'd be dangerous. Him and Lamar. You got to respect the run. And they don't have J.K. Dobbins, so you know they could definitely be in the market yeah. for, you know, that type yeah. of move. Yeah. Okay. That's all they really, you know they want to run the ball. Respect. Respect, man. Respect. I like it then, bro. I like it. You got anything final for him, man? I'm good. All right. All right. Well, my dog, as always, is a blast, man. You know we're going to spend a block do this again. Yeah. Let's get it, man. Let's get it. My dog. Already. Hey, hey, before you go, who Flo Mo got this week, man? What's the word? What's the word? Uh, Flo Mo, we got. <laughs> I just had a blank out moment. <laughs> we <laughs> you see, I just had a blank out moment. <laughs> but we got we got Southeastern. Right? A tough game. Southeastern's third in the conference. Okay. Lead, okay. The, lead the league defensive rushing. Okay. So defense, you know, defensive juggernaut it should be. We came off a big win last week. Turn defense up. Got a big stop. Uh-huh. Yeah, defense played pretty well. Uh, offense scored. Offense do what offense do. Okay. So, okay. It should be a dog fight, man. We got to go in there. Man, well, let's go then, man. Hey, we ain't coming back with well, nothing less than a win. You already know what time it is, man. And it's a five-star matchup because you're all in that thing, man. All right? So go ahead and take care of business, my dog. Go ahead and take care of business, man. Appreciate you as always, though. Peace. Peace, bro.